What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to the video today guys. Today we have the new Spider-Man hydration bottles and we are finally going to be taking a look at them today. So I am excited to open these bad boys up and take a look at them and taste test them. And I'm actually surprised that these didn't explode or anything because I think it's like five to 10 degrees out right now and these were sitting outside. And I don't know how cold it is in the Amazon trucks, but I've been seeing a lot of carbonated G Fuel cans and bottles exploding because of the cold weather because they're actually freezing um, in transportation. So just be aware of that. Make sure to bring in any packages that uh, the Postal Service or Amazon leaves that are carbonated. So any G Fuel cans or bottles, make sure to bring those inside right away if you can. So anyways, we finally got our hands on the Spider-Man hydration bottles, ladies and gentlemen. So I am so very excited to try these. Um, I love the hydration bottles. I've had all of my M fams already. I've had a good amount of the Phajax. I had all of the Kiwi strawberry ones. Speaking of Kiwi strawberry hydration bottles, I hope those come back soon. I think they were having an issue with the color. Uh, the color of the Kiwi strawberry bottles seemed to fade from like a pink to a brown over time because it's using natural colors with no like preservatives for it. So they tended to fade really quickly. So G Fuel's trying to fix that. But I'm actually quite interested if they're using artificial colors or not with these because these are very, very red. So Let's go ahead, open these up, and give them a taste, ladies and gentlemen. So, while I'm opening these up, ladies and gents, I want to say that the Spider-Man Radioactive Lemonade G Fuel flavor, if you don't know, is supposed to be basically a, the Spider-Man uh, popsicle with the gumball eyes. So, it's supposed to be a bubblegum lemonade with a little bit of like an ice pop feel to it. Um, I have had the Spider-Man cans and the Spider-Man tub. If you guys want to see those reviews, I will link them at the end of the video and in the description. There is no way that is natural colors. There is no way that that's natural colors, ladies and gentlemen, unless they're using like a ton of beet juice or something. That is the reddest G Fuel bottle we have ever had, I think. Let me actually compare these to the uh, Black Cherry. I guess it's about the same, ladies and gentlemen. I guess it's about the same as the black cherry. So we've got the black cherry here and then the Spider-Man here, and I guess the colors are about the same. It looks like G Fuel is using vegetable juice for the coloring. So let's go ahead and get a close look at the radioactive lemonade G Fuel bottle, ladies and gentlemen. Now this is the hydration bottle, just FYI. So we've got no caffeine in here and we've got focused vitamins and antioxidants that have been added. Um, and so basically it's just like the G Fuel can, but without out the caffeine. So if you're younger, you can have it or if you have issues with caffeine. Here is the label if you guys wanna take a look at it. Uh, the, it does look like there is no artificial colors in this one either, um, which is really awesome. I'm glad to see that. With it being that bright red as well, that is awesome to see that there's no artificial colors in here um, with it being that red, because I, I absolutely love this red. And to achieve that with no artificial coloring, I think that's awesome. And it looks like they're using vegetable juice. It doesn't seem to say, it says fruit and vegetable juice. So I don't know if we're using uh, beet juice here, what's going on, I'm not exactly sure. But there we go, one last look at the bottle. It's got like this almost gold uh, highlights here. It's really, really cool what they did. So obviously inspired by Spider-Man No Way Home, see it in the movie theaters, Radioactive Lemonade, G Fuel, Sparkling Hydration. There's the top, there's the bottom. Not much to take a look at when it comes to the hydration bottles, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and pop this open and give it a smell. I like this better than just regular bubblegum G Fuel, but I still don't think it's an amazing, amazing flavor, but let's see what I think because right now, in my personal opinion, I would go M Fam Punch as my favorite hydration bottle, then probably Kiwi Strawberry, and then maybe Phase X. Um, but let's go ahead and give this one a taste and see if it gets into my top three for the hydration bottles. Let's go ahead and give this a smell. Very bubblegum smelling. Yeah, I get a strong bubble gum off of that. I almost don't get much of the lemonade at all when it comes to the hydration bottle. Interesting. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and give it a taste. The sparkling hydration G Fuel bottles. Here we go. Radioactive lemonade. Oh, man. She's still nice and cool from being outside as well. Oh, man, that is really good, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my. That is really good. That is better than Phase X, without a doubt. That is better than Yuzu, without a doubt. Better than Bebot. Better than Black Cherry. I'd say that's better than Kiwi Strawberry, too. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know if I'd say it's better than MFAM Punch, but right now, this is my second favorite hydration bottle, hands down. That is really good, ladies and gents. That is fire. And they absolutely nailed the color on this one as well. Oh my God, that is absolutely insane. Obviously, some people are not gonna like the bubblegum. You know, there's a lot of people that don't really like bubblegum. I personally am a bubblegum lover in terms of just bubblegum, the flavor, the drink. I didn't really have bubblegum a lot in terms of like medicine and toothpaste and stuff when I was younger. So I don't really have that uh, brain thought where bubblegum means medicine and toothpaste. Uh, so for me, I really enjoy the taste of bubblegum. But if you are someone who doesn't, I probably would not recommend these. But I would recommend you go with the MFAM Punch Hydration. In terms of a ranking, ladies and gentlemen, I've got to give the Spider-Man Radioactive Lemonade Hydration Bottles a solid 8.9 out of 10 in terms of hydration bottles. Absolutely amazing. I mean, it gets second place for me right now. So bussing. Like, I feel like these are going to be mad, mad good. You know, once G Fuel nails them all, they're just gonna be amazing. So let me know what you guys think. If you have gotten your radioactive lemonade hydration bottles yet, of course, I will link all of them down below if you guys wanna pick them up. Thank you also for using my Amazon link down below because that link does give me, I think a percent maybe from Amazon. Amazon is real dirty about how much they give you. It's pretty bad, but Thank you for anybody that does use that link because it does support me. I do really appreciate it because you cannot buy these on the G Fuel website. They're only available now on Amazon. I think it's something to do with shipping and Amazon's just easier to get them out. So G Fuel went with that. But if you guys want to pick any of them up, use that link. If you guys want to pick anything up on G Fuel, use code CHOCK. It should be 30% off starting about on the 13th. So thank you to anybody that does use code CHOCK as well on the G4 website. I will catch you guys in the next video. And shout out to these people up on screen for using code CHOCK. Peace out, ladies and gentlemen.